AT&T has some price increases coming on some of their older retired plans. Hi, I'm Jen with the Mobile Internet Resource Center, and AT&T recently announced that there are some price increases coming on a few of their older retired plans. Now, these price increases are going to go into effect on August billing. They affect consumer lines only, and also it only affects people who signed up for these plans prior to August 2022. So the first group of plans getting the, the price increase are hotspot lines on the retired Unlimited Plus, Unlimited Choice, and Unlimited Choice 2 accounts. And we wanted to particularly mention the Unlimited Plus accounts because when those plans were available from about 2017 to 18, you could add a mobile hotspot line onto those plans for only $20 a month, and that included unlimited data on that hotspot line. So when they AT&T announced in 2018 that those plans were being retired and that option was going to go away, we did announce that uh, to our readers and say that this was a really good deal that was going to be going away and if anyone was interested that they should go ahead and sign up for it. So there may be a lot of you who still have that plan available. So if you do and still have um, a hotspot line on one of those accounts, then the price is going to be going up by $10 a month. And again, it was only $20 originally on that un Unlimited Plus account. So if you do still have it, you're now going to be paying $30 a month, but that's still a really good deal for unlimited data on a hotspot line. One thing to mention though is that the, those lines only have 4K data. They do not, they are not compatible with 5G. Uh, the other uh, group of accounts that is going to get the price increase are unlimited elite smartphone lines. And those, uh, that was the top tier plan that was available from AT&T up until last year. Uh, the plans were $85 a month and included unlimited on-device data as well as 4K ultra high def streaming use in Canada and Mexico and 40 gigabytes of mobile hotspot data. So when those plans were retired, they were replaced with unlimited premium, which is a very similar plan, uh, same price and everything. But the new, the current plans have 50 gigabytes of mobile hotspot data as opposed to 40. So the, if you do still have one of those lines, the price is now going up by $2.50 per line per month. So it's not a huge increase. Uh, one other difference between the two lines is that the Unlimited Elite came with the perk of HBO Max, which is now just called Max, and the Unlimited Premium lines that are currently available do not have that perk. So if you are still on Unlimited Elite and that uh, HBO Max perk is important to you, then it might be worth keeping it even with the $2.50 price increase. But if that perk is not particularly important to you, then you might want to think about going ahead and switching to unlimited premium because it would be the same price, $85 a month, and you would get the extra 10 gigabytes of mobile hotspot data. Now, as of yet, we have not seen any information from AT&T about any price increases coming to the mobily connected car plans. Uh, if we do see anything like that, we will be sure to let you know. Uh, but that's what's happening right now. And we have a story with all the details on our website. If you want to take a look at that, you can find it at rvmobileinternet.com. These videos are brought to you by our premium members, our mobile internet aficionados. They make it possible for us to track this news and create these videos. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up, leave a comment, subscribe to our channel, or better yet, consider becoming a member yourself.